Hi, I'm Carolyn. And I'm Olivia. And we are your Totally Teenage Twins. Welcome back to Squared. Hi guys, if you guys are new here, I'm Caroline. And I'm Olivia. And we post here in Squared every single Thursday. So for today's video, we are probably going to be answering our number one most asked question, and that is, what is it like to be on a collaborative YouTube channel, aka Squared? So that's probably our most asked question. What's it like? What do you guys do? So how does it all work? I was just talking to one of my doctors today, and she asked all the same questions. So hopefully this video can answer everyone's questions. We are going to take you guys on a little behind the scenes look. Now before we get into the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to Squared down below. Let's get started. Hi guys, we are currently at the Dollar Tree and we are going to pick up a series of snacks we want to try in our video. Um, like we haven't actually done a video yet, so like this is filmed ahead of time, so I don't know how many we're gonna do. Are we each gonna pick up five we're snacks? Do, um, together. Just pick out five snacks. Yeah, we're just gonna pick out five snacks. We're just gonna try some of their brands and see what fun, cheap, and simple snacks are. Yeah, right now we're filming it's Easter time, so maybe we'll get some seasonal festival things too. We'll see you guys in a sec. So guys, I'm here to give you guys an update. We're currently in the candy sweet treat aisle. Um, so like, how we're gonna do this is we're not trying to get like name brands, we're just trying to get like dollar store brands. So we obviously know how Sour Patch Kids taste. So that wouldn't be any fun. So we're gonna try to get some different brands. And yeah, so that's kind of the goal for this. So we have our items. Hi guys, it's Olivia. So I just got back from physical therapy. Kelly just got back from her clubs and we joined in a military kid club. But now we are totally ready to film. So today is Wednesday. Um, we are going to start today's again. It's the Dollar Tree um, Food Taste Test Challenge. So if you see, I have um, I have laid out all of the snacks. And as you see, my room's kind of messy. That's another behind the scenes. Now we just kind of shove everything to the back of the room. And But then this, this half of the room, it looks great. Anyway though, so I have sorted out all of our snacks into um, Olivia's pile and the back here is Caroline's pile. We have our two seats today so I decided to go with the gray cube and a black um, little chair. And then I've got the light ring up. Usually I do more of the setup and then Caroline does the editing and then she'll get like the camera focused and whatnot. So yeah, we'll keep you guys updated. Olivia's answering the door while I sit up right now. We have our camera and we have our light ring. It's a gloomy day, um, so like the sun wouldn't have usually set right now, but since it's darker out, we have to bring out our lights. Sometimes it might be like artificial, if it's like, you know, like the in-between stages. So we're just gonna roll with it since we have a tighter room. Sometimes the light doesn't always even the distribute, but it's okay. Um, my makeup's kind of washed off, but I don't really wanna put it, I don't wanna put it all back on. I, that's why like, I prefer to, if you're gonna film a video, I prefer to film on a weekend so that way you have ready time to get ready. So if you guys just saw the time lapse, that was a good old old fashioned game of gray chair, black chair. So usually Caroline focuses the video. She makes sure our heads like aren't cropped off and I sit in the gray chair. Then I go back to the black chair, she adjusts it, then back to the gray, back to the black, until we think it's all picture perfect. Um, we're gonna go touch up our makeup just so we don't look a little red with the bright lights and we will update you guys then. is the uh, Cotton Tails Cotton Candy Fluffy Stuff. Um, when I went to the back of the store, near, near, more near like the food section, they had the regular kind, but the, I saw this when I first walked into the Easter section, which is also where I picked up kind of now later. Oh, that's what they're Cotton Tails. These might be seasonal, so these are called Cotton Tails, like, you know, Peter Cotton Tail. Yeah, because on the back, it shows if the real the real color is this blue, this fluffy stuff. I don't see how this is any different looking at the picture. I think they are. And, and I, I think might be sports. And I hope these are different flavors too, because I'm not yeah. a blue rabbit. Yeah, so I feel like these are, these are the brand charm. So I think you can actually get these anywhere, but I feel like these are really notorious for me. So at the dollar store. Okay, guys, we just finished filming. So now I'll set you guys up, and you can watch us take some fabulous thumbnail pictures. Okay, so we have officially finished filming. We finished taking our thumbnails, so now what will happen is Caroline will either go throw the SD card in the computer and get stuff whipped up, or <laughs> she'll just wait till tomorrow or another day. On Monday night. Same thing with me, I can start picking up. We just have to put away the, um, obviously all the filming equipment and the supplies, clean up, 
vacuum. We usually try to do all that stuff. So we'll just go straight to our pantry. It'll be really easy. Yeah. So yeah. So now we're all done with filming, and now you guys will start to see some more of the technical elements and aspects to this. So we get asked a lot about how we edit our videos. So basically, I use Premiere Elements. So right here talks about the project, and then over here I have actions I can add videos. Um, right here, and then here is where the videos I already have added. Then down here I have my timelines. So each one of these um, is like video one is like one video clip and then it shows the audio and basically when I want to um, trim something I'll click right here and then I'll click the scissor button and then it'll cut it for me and by doing that I can cut different parts out and then I can um, I can delete certain parts too what I want so yeah I basically add in all the clips right here I splice them so I cut them and cut all the bad parts out and then I have them all right here I edit them basically by just like clicking one and then I will watch the video if that makes sense and then I will decide if I want to keep it or not then I can just pause it and figure all that out and yeah and then I'll add um, some music we'll go down here in the music part if you do narrate on the music part sorry guys if you do narration it'll go right here um, if you want to do a second video that'll go over it you'll have video two and then your audio and you can keep doing it like that you can delete these tracks if you want to this is definitely a more basic editing software but it all pretty much is the same when it comes to timelines um, as far as video editing goes it's just how complex your timeline is but it is all done off of the timeline I guess method if you want to call it so basically the video is pretty much done it is actually done so I have everything here over here I went ahead and added the cards I'll show you guys how to do this um, I like we have our little banner here so I just add this on and then I can move this around on the screen um, it obviously goes right here so I just place it myself and then I take our video and I cut it in half and then basically I add our intro and then I add the square the square is like its own video if that makes sense so I just add the video and then it resumes and then like right here I add music and then I lower the music by going to tools and then audio mixer and I can change how much I do these so that the video will be quieter um, so yeah, I basically quiet this down and then when no one's talking, it seems louder, which works perfectly. Like right here, you can hear the music. Perfect. Now that I'm done, I'm going to go to export and share. I'm going to go to devices and then I'm going to save it on mobile version 180. I'm going to, then I save it to my computer. So I'm going to go to YouTube and then squared. And then I'm going to save in dollar store snacks right here. And then I'm going to save it and then we'll wait like 10, 20 minutes and it should be done. Thank you guys so much for watching that video. I think it felt good to kind of get the offer chess and finally get out there. You never really see this stuff and from someone who's, you know, we've been on both sides of kind of being, I guess, a little bit in the YouTube world and then like just like being a regular watcher and viewer. So it was really fun to get to kind of talk about that a little bit. Um, of course, if you guys have any questions, make sure to let us guys know down below. Um, I think that was definitely fun. So yeah, it was really interesting you know, that we answered your guys' questions because sometimes it's fresh to kind of be in the dark and not know like what's going on <laughs> with people and how like, the whole YouTube world works. So I really truly hope that we answered your questions. But before you guys go, if you guys love vlogs be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see yesterday's video here in squared click right over here if you want to see all the other videos that we posted here in squared click right up there and click right over here subscribe that way you can get a new video from a different set of twins every single day of the week we will see you guys next week bye